Do empty lightsaber hilts make good display pieces? That depends. So if you purchase an empty lightsaber hilt from Ultra Sabers, then your lightsaber hilt is going to have a switch hole like this. So it's either going to be an AV switch hole or it'll be a guarded switch hole. Either way, it's a hole. So you're probably going to want to cover up this hole with something. So a lot of people will just end up installing an AV switch or a guarded switch, but you really can cover it up any way that you want. So you could get a little creative there because you don't need the actual functionality of a button. So you can do whatever you want. This is pretty common with a lot of other Saber companies as well. So these two are Ultra Saber's hilts. This is a Sentinel V4 and this is a Dark Mantis. And you can see the switch hole in both of those. Now this hilt here is from One Replicas and same deal, there's the switch hole right here. And this is the SSQY. So that's a pretty common thing to look for. If, you look, if you're looking at empty hilts, don't be surprised if you see a lot of hilts with empty switch holes like that, where you'd need to, at the very least, install some kind of switch or you know cover it up somehow to make it display worthy. Now, occasionally you can purchase empty lightsaber hilts where you need to do next to nothing. <laughs> so this is a Flashkin 7 from Roman Props and it's great right out of the gate. So this is fully assembled. There are no empty switch holes. I could display this, use this for cosplay, whatever, just right away and I don't need to do anything. So that is another possibility. You do have some empty saber hilts that are ready for display right away. So those are the main things to consider with empty hilts. All of them could be display worthy. Just keep in mind that if you purchase empty hilts from some companies or certain models of empty hilts, you might have that switch hole that you'd want to cover up somehow.